Yes, finally, finally, finally. Though, of course, we're back with another really quick Pokemon Go video. So, of course, so we got some new news slash info, of course, for the game and everything. Of course, all the next December content, basically the content from December all the way to March 1st, basically. So, we got a lot of new info, a lot of new stuff, though. So, let's get started. I'm gonna go ahead and get started now because there's so much info. I had to actually we do this video because I didn't like the way it turned out beforehand, but gonna go ahead and get everything started though. So for December content, it's been saying everything is scheduled from uh, 10 a.m. or actually, oh, so, okay, yeah. By the time I upload this, it will be 10, 1 p.m. PST time or either um, it'll be East um, CET. Um, so for some people, it's already started because I actually did get a restaurant raid. The one I got sucked, it was horrible. It was like two, 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 and it's like two star. It was not good. I'm probably gonna try for that or give it to somebody because I, I really don't need it though. So um, yeah. I think I'm gonna say I'm looking at my friend code in the video, so I don't know, just kind of thought of that. So yeah, December 1st, January 1st, whatever time zone you know, like Japan. Um, everything, of course, or just, you know, go online and see how, like, what time zone, and just look up and everything. Uh, we'll have the next breakthrough for research will be a Dino, or Dino, or Dino, I'll call it, like, Dino, Dino. Um, it's actually really good, because that Pokemon's in really rare, it's in eggs, so I recommend highly going for those for research. research. Uh, Volbi will be leaving, by the time I upload this, it'll probably be gone. Um, I know the season of the ship ends in seven hours, where it's gonna get replaced with, um, like, the Hamaj event that's coming up. Well, of course, like, probably, like, celebrating the, um, not brilliant damage shine problem because we got a brilliant damage shine problem for those games releases we're probably gonna get like you know a release for because uh, a lot of people said our you know that scissor from like rc is no not scissor is literally coming we could get like i don't know like a little bit now uh, um like custom a um i see yes um uh, maybe it's excuse me um you know version of um Zorark. that actually would be cool because this goes to normal like no fight techniques are going to affect it either that's going to be insane though so of course we got that we got new raids of course actually looks really good so we have from December first 10 a.m local time uh whatever times we're and stuff like that of course like i said though December first 10 a.m local time to the 16th um of course, we'll have Rush Ram, and of course, Zekrom. Okay, they do have Shiny Chains, because I was writing, and I was like, oh, hey, they do have Shiny in the game. So, yeah, Zekrom and Rush Ram, um, Zekrom, Rush Ram and Zekrom will both be in raids at the same time, and stuff like that, of course. The raid hours will be on the 1st, uh, 8th, and 15th. Of course, on the second half, um, 10 a.m., again, same time and everything, uh, from 16th to the 3rd, 1st, we have Kirim. So, unfortunately, a lot of people really wanted Black and White Kirim. This is from the game from Black and White 2, the sequel games. In this case, if you didn't play Unova, um, there we go. That's their, um, that's their other form I actually pulled up, though. So, so it's not in the game still, yo, but I had a feeling Kirim was going to come back anyway in the raids. I, I just had, like, a really weird feeling. Um, it takes me months. most. Okay. No. But, yeah, I had a really weird feeling it was going to come back in raids anyway, though. So, I, I figured, I was like, okay, December Ice makes sense now. Uh, we'll have a couple new raids. Um, make a steal is coming to the game for the first time same time um, from the first to 30 uh, to 23rd uh, from the 23rd to the um, 6th we'll have um, a bomb of snow big up snow which actually it's i think snow for such a bomb no snow i know a lot of people don't really talk about it too much though but it's actually a decent pokemon uh mega steel is coming to the game for the first time it looks really sick i think it's shiny x it's pretty cool i was also going to do like a hacker that had like a diamond kind of like had, like a light blue slash teal and it had like his mega form it looks like pretty cool i think it's shiny form it's like still like a gold dusk kind of cool thing of course, we got spot hours from 6 p.m. to 7 p.m. local time, so whatever time zone you're in, whatever, like for me right now, it's 7.09. So when, when spot hour hits and stuff like that, it'll be the, all these Pokemon. Um, Electabuzz, on the 7th, we'll have Time to Transfer Candy. Yeah, Time to Transfer Candy. Uh, we'll have Time to Evolve the XP for Magmar. A uh, will be on the 21st, which I had a fun with. I was like, it's gonna make its way into this event anyway, because again, like it's December. Time to Catch XP. Of course, another time to, um, ca oh, ta oh, Time to Catch Candy for, um, um, coaching. So yeah, this one's really, really worth it. Again, if you even go level 50 or beyond, I still think collecting experience is still good because it'll be good. A lot of people are still talking about like, you know, level 60, potent not potentially coming soon, but a lot of people are still like, you know, brand of experience. The time to evolve the XP is really good. I got almost like 40,000, 50,000 50, experience. Again, you can have a, um, look, if you have a lucky egg on, you can get almost like 40, like almost a raid theme. Like if you, I don't know, you might magically raid a restaurant, but it's like more that day. I recommend doing that though because you have the lucky egg on, you have time to evolve the XP is really good. The attempt to Trevor Candy's been again, we had that like Christmas, we just had it with the um events. Again, it's just so we just had time to turn for candy so much though. And also if Electro Buzz and Magmar will have of course a spot um their um community days from last year. Um we can get the extra community day moved in December from the 17th, I think to the 19th. Um so I had I think 10 a.m. local time. Um all the community Pokemon from last year will be in egg and rates. And you can actually whatever, like for example, if you have an Electro Buzz right now and you want to evolve and get the special flamethrower move, you can get it like when that when December from, from the 17th to the 19th of December this year. And 
pretty good for Mac Mario will have its um, community move for, I think, uh, Thunderbolt, I think. So you can evolve it and get, that, get it there as well. Again, you can actually, again, like I said, all the community that come out from last year will be in two Columbia eggs and one star rate. So you can actually get their exclusive move, though. So it's really good. Summer seems really good. Again, you see November, you can see December. We have incense dates randomly on Sunday the 5th, uh, 10 a.m. local time to 5 p.m. local time. That's literally, um, that's, that's um, literally, um, um, a, um, not spot that hour, but that's literally a, um, um, a community day time. So yeah, Swan will be swung in a while, of course, so I mean, you, can, you can get a shiny version of it. Well, if you go, go in the um, shop and get a one box bundle, you get times two incense. From, from fuel research, you can just look at some. They have a Memble Swine, um, it'll have the Agent Power move. I know Powder Snow for his fast move and his charge move for Avalanche is actually really good for Shadow and Regular though, so it's really good. Memble Swine is actually, I think, one of the best. Um, Attackers in the kingdom though for that though for shiny and regular though, so I recommend doing that. We also have Seal, Jinx, um, Sneasel, Snover, which I completely forgot that I forgot was even in the game. Uh, Snover, which I thought it was. Snover, I'll have shiny chances, and um, of course, Vanilla and Dark, um, Gallery, Dark Maka. Because so, you know, they're gonna be very spawns because the background's a little bit different. Uh, so for all ice taps, it'll be 10 a.m., 12 p.m., 1 p.m., 2 p.m., 3 p.m., 4, 4 p.m. So it'll start at that time. Again, this is the whole entire day in general, though. So it'll be like a community day, basically. And that's for the uh, first half from um, from 11 a.m. to 4 p.m. Then after that, um, from 12 p.m. to... Um, I think like it's going to be the next day, something like that. Or like the next couple of hours after that. It'll be... Um, I think that's how it will be, I think, the, for the first day. Is it for the first day? Yeah, same day and stuff like that. It seems like it's going to have like a different time. It's going to be different timing. So um, for 12 p.m., 1 p.m., 2 p.m., 3 p.m., 4 p.m., 5 p.m. We'll have, of course, Onyx. I was actually getting, like, says, getting a Mega Seal. So we have, I've seen the stats already. It's already been leaked. I think I did a short on that. I actually want to upload that because it's coming because I did do a short on that. Um, it will have, of course, like I said, I'll have a Shiny Chance, Cubone, um, Rhyhorn. Um, again, like I said, I will have this community day, community day move Rock Worker. So if you want to get one, if all be during the times, 17th and 19th, and make sure you get that. Again, all the community that came out from last year will be in eggs. And it'll be in raids, and you also get their exclusive moves. Like that, for example, you have a Hundo Rhyhorn, you can easily evolve it uh, to Rhyperior and get like your your Rock Rider moves and stuff like that. Um, Whooper has a Shiny Chance. Gampy does not have a Shiny Chance, so I don't know that. Um, Barboach, and of course, Larvitar again, are really rare Pokemon to get and stuff like that. Really good, so I recommend doing these. This all give you at different times and stuff like that, of course. So, so I will be at different times with Pokemon. We approach an incense at all times, all, all different times. So I think even if you have an incense, you can probably get like the ground side Pokemon as well. And yeah, like I said, Onyx is going to be really good. It's really rare Pokemon to on the bottom too, though. So yeah, that'll be on the 5th of December. I'll probably make a little, like a little kind of like guide going over everything, though, of course. Though. So yeah. Let's see how much is going to be here. Like I said, it'll be from the 1st of the um, March 1st, from December 1st to March 1st, 10 a.m. local time. There's all different friends that are going to have in the right guide on it up. So see how much we'll have like a couple little things down here. It seems like um for like all the different, not teams, but it seems like we're going to have a Johto tour event also got leaked as well though. So I think that's going to be really cool. Uh, but this one's really good. Like for the, for the Mystic team, of course it's going to be time to start those for each day though. You hit the Dino Head, you'll get the um, Pokeballs, um, berries, like all this, like we all this uh, benefits. Again, like I said, it does have goals though. So you go ahead, like you can, the time it starts, you'll get the end of the goal. There's some experience, you'll get the goal, this goal, and it's how much you'll get. Catching Pokemon basically, getting experience, and of course, Stardust is actually really good. I recommend doing all this stuff. Again, you, I think you can pre purchase the um, ticket and stuff like that. Of course, it'll be on the 10th, this will be on the 14th. So it seems like it's gonna be like a monthly kind of, it's gonna be a monthly thing for now. We're now to February though, so. This one's free though, but I think for for everybody, but I think these two are basically because it looked like it's like, oh my gosh, it's um. You know, because you have to pre purchase it. I feel like this should all just been free in general though, for all players because it's been really good. For, if you're a free player, you're starting out in the game, you really re want to recommend getting that Stardust because that's a lot of Stardust though, and that's really good and really cool. Uh, Dodo Tour is actually not a bad either. A lot of experience to get that, get that experience, especially for level like me. I'll probably, I'll probably be like level 40 by next year, like January, by like February, just because I'm, I'm at level like what 37 going on to 38. So, um, yeah. I get crazy stuff like that, and of course, um, and this one's actually really good too. Like, all the benefits are all actually really good. Like, a lot of people go like, oh, I'm already level 50, get more experience, build it up. That's what I'm gonna do. Um, monthly bonuses, of course, you get instant. Oh, yeah, time for this one, you, um, for um, the um, um, for February, it'll be um, increased XL candy from hatching eggs times two experience from hatching eggs. So, this one's really good though. Like, yeah, hatching eggs working with stuff like that though. So, um, yeah, it's gonna be a lot of bonuses and benefits there for that. I want to say it's for probably, again, the Ooh, and White Bat's in here. Pupitor's really good. Gallery is exactly good. That's one's really good. Gligar. Just got um, a Shadow and stuff like that. Of course, Gumi's in here as a really rare Pokemon. You get Dino in here again at the, um, this minimum, maximum, and stuff like that. Again, this is really good. I recommend doing this highly, though. But the first one's free. I think the other two are like pre purchased, though. But the, first, the free ones are well safe, but with the way better benefits. Also, we'll have different spawns and stuff like that, depending on your location. These are all the city Pokemon, all the uh, starters and stuff like that. Um, just little bonuses. 
uh, forest, mountains, bodies of water. And Lapras is really good. Vivas can be really good for its evolution. Aerodactyl is really rare. Um, we're showing um, Muna is going to be here too as well. Uh, Kogo, again, Skunk Bots are pretty okay, though, like I said. Again, like, they, depending on what area you're in, though. For me, it's usually kind of forest and cities, though, so it's probably going to be really these two. Probably mountains, maybe bodies of water. Um, I don't know, it's going to be really different, though. You can probably tell because you know, your radar is going to change at the bottom of the screen because all Pokemon do end up changing, though. All the different spawns for all of them, of course, so all the eggs have been different as well. We're gonna have smaller little eggs. There's all the bonuses and stuff like that, of course. We've got the Johto Joe coming up from 26th to 27th. Um, because last year, I think we had the Kento event though, so this year we had the Johto. So I think it'd be really good. Again, it's pre purchase, you have to get chicken, I think, and stuff like that, though. Um, the Johto Shore. I uh, just all the, yeah, the recaps for all the um, community days and stuff like that, like I said. That's all the Pokemon can, like I said. If you have a Gibble, you know, you get the, you'll get exclusive, you'll get exclusive move when you have all the Gibby and uh, to guard turn up. So it goes for Tepic, et cetera, et cetera. Again, any Pokemon that you had, you may miss out on the evolution, you know, Dust Skull, whatever, boom, you can go ahead and get it. There. And all the egg pull, again, we have a little bit of bonuses here. The Ray Passes are still the same. Gifts, I think you get one extra candy while um, trading, you get one extra so candy guaranteed when you um, when trading. Though. So, yeah, a lot of people do trade this, especially with the Gento event and stuff like that, and all this stuff. This is gonna be really worth it. Yeah, your team gets me spent focus out. That's gonna be, I think, permanent. Um, again, like I said, they just kind of added this in here, I guess. So, you know, we don't have to because again, like, this is like three months. This is a mission for three months, though, so it makes sense, though. So, why they added all this, we got instant inf affecting this while walking. That's still really good, also. Um, the we standing still also because I think this beforehand, like before they updated the game, uh, we standing still, you can actually can get more experience. Uh, it works for you, you can get um, more effectiveness as well when you're standing still because again, a lot of people are probably stuck at home doing this event, and that's really good because I think that if it was here like all, all the time for the game, then they just changed it. It's good that's coming back though, so if you're stuck home, whatever you can just kind of do it, especially for me though. Um, Playing on movies soon though, so again, I've been moving around a lot better anyway though, so yeah, just taking out different places I can pull up Pokemon Go and get all this stuff. So again, all this stuff will be live pretty much a couple more hours. I cannot wait though. And the egg pulls have been different though. I think they're all pretty much the same though. Oh, Colter's in here, I think. I think that one's new. No, 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 okay. These are all the regular egg pulls, but they also have been all changed. We have smaller eggs now. I think it's, some of it's already live in the game. What's this one? These are all the events coming up. The Dragon Spiral Tower events coming up. We have the Christmas event for part one and two. The 16th to the 31st. But the Dragon Spiral Tower again in black and white. This is based on the Dragon Spiral Tower for all Ice and Dragon Spiral Pokemon. And we have a couple again. Probably like we're going to get probably like all spawns. Me and Boo, um, Golur, Draw. I'm drawing again right here. A lot of people really want the shiny being in the game. It actually has a sick shiny, the light and green and um, orange on its face. It actually looks really good. I doubt it's going to come to the game because we've seen like Punkaboo Phantom in the game. They do not have shinies at all. Again, we're probably going to make sure to get it. Or, you know, they could be like, okay, it's coming in the game, new shiny. They never do that anyway. Like on release, they never release. Like, for example, when Dragon gets released, it's probably not going to have like a shiny and stuff like that. It'll probably be the same pretty much though. So, yeah. Um, I think that was pretty much it for all the events and stuff like that. I think this is just the cups. Yeah, all the community Pokemon like Shinx will have Psychic Fangs, Sivy will have like, um, we have Frenzy Plant and stuff like that. Like, all the community Pokemon will have all the crucial moves again, like I said, from the 17th, I think 17th, 18th, and 19th. Um, you can get, like I said, get all the community, community Pokemon with their moves. Um, Discord, I don't really need to get that. Um, I show I like with Hydro Cannon, um, Dust Skull with, um, Shadow Ball, again, all the community Pokemon with moves will be back. Even ones from last year, like Pip Up Hydro Cannon, um, Alexander like Counter again. Like, if you have Pokemon from last year, like, for me, I got Pip Up again. Wait until that day comes. Boom, evolve and get my hydro, get my hydro cannon. That's gonna be really, really worth it and good though. I love that so much though. So yeah, um, I think it's pretty much it though. Um, and of course, the, um, the um, weekly bundle box will always be the same though for the um, 6th, 13th, 20th, and 27th. So yeah, again, uh, these are all the cups that have been updated and everything. Of course, though, we have the holiday cup here for Ultra League. We have the um, holiday cup in terms of Stardust rewards for um. December and everything, again, this is a whole cup for December and everything. All the um, different leagues and stuff like that, all the different times and everything. I think this one's, um, all the new Pokemon have been changed. I know we get the last one outfit, we get um, Pika Libre back. Um, all the different Pokemon you can get from all the different um, tiers and stuff like that. Of course, current, whatever current rate is going on, you get that list of Pokemon at 20 and beyond. And again, like I said, there's a whole bunch of Pokemon in here. All the um, typical, typical stuff right there. I think that's pretty much it though. Yeah, that's pretty much it down there. Uh, I think this one's pretty much the same as well. The other different Pokemon that have been banned and stuff like that. Pokemon are not allowed. I know Swampert's on here. Nido Queen, yeah. Umbreon, disgusting Pokemon on here. All the, um, again, they all been revamped and remixed though. So, of course, a lot of Pokemon have been um, changed up and stuff like that. Um, all the new Pokemon with all their moves and stuff like that. Again, like, the mainly Incinerate's on here. Rock Tomb, I think, though. So, uh, yeah. Ooh, Octillery, a lot of cons are really good. Um, all the Love Cups gonna be on here from the 17th to the 21st. Again, probably about on day on PST, um, time and all that stuff. Again, all the red and, like, um, yeah, oh, Crocodile's in here. That's really good. Please follow up Pokemon. You, kinda, you know, you get like bonus damage. You're gonna catch and stuff like that. Gallier, oh, Gallier Soul King is gonna be on here. Um, Mr. Mime, um, I don't know. I'm a, 
I just thought of something like all these Pokemon get spawns, but no, they're gonna be um by reward, Pokemon rewards and stuff like that that could be up here. Yeah, a lot of pink and red though, because of course we're done with it. You know, fur fruit with the heart fur fruit. This is all the new stuff that's basically coming up for the game that got leaked. I'll uh, probably the new Pokestop updates coming up though soon because um you guys know Pokestop are getting updated. You can um I see the more you spend the more rewards you get, you can level it up. People around you can also level up as well. Like for example, there's only like two or three people are spending Pokestop at the same time, they can also level up. Because the goes up to three, I think it gets tougher the more level ups. Um, I think it disappears after a day. I think it's just, I, think, I might be permanent there for level three because you can easily just, you know, walk into the uh, focus down and just spin it. Also, I think when your buddy, when you help, when it gets, you know, the higher the level is, even like your buddy can even help out you as well, though. It has three different tiers and stuff like that. You can definitely tell. But yeah, like, I think when your buddy now, when you spin a stop, you'll get a heart, I believe, now. So they get a point to the new focus down thing, which is good because I hated them for a long time. Because yeah, again, no one's going to go to new focus down every day on a single day. The new eggs have been in here as well. Um, what's this one? The new backgrounds and locations have been different as well. I think tracking is now in the game, so walking distance, it seems like when you walk, you can actually see like, where you can walk and stuff like that. Pokemon height has been updated, buddy, um, buddy list right there. Um, yeah, use buddy, number of um, friends. It's like any view, point of view, lucky friend. I think like, all this stuff is going to be updated, hologram box, um, all the new eggs have been updated and stuff like that in the game already. So again, some people already got this stuff, all this stuff early. Pretty much all the same stuff, this one's for rays, heights. Oh, again, they also look pretty much old ones. This one's all new ones and stuff like that. Of course, going to be updated and everything. This one is, I think, all the eggs and stuff like that. Smaller eggs. I think they're probably already alive in some countries. Again, like, testing out stuff like that. This one is, I think, enabling frame rate now. It seems like that. And of course, name suggestions have been the thing that's well now. So, for example, you're trying to name yourself Lewis, but the name's already taken. It'll give you, like, this is a pretty example. Like, like I said, like, Lewis is right here. So, you can be like, boom. But we'll recommend, oh, like, you can play Lewis YT, Lewis YT1, or whatever, though. Just in case your video is not available. That's pretty much everything I want to kind of cover on COVID today. Again, a lot of stuff from Pokemon going on. I love it. We've got the new, um, um, Go Battle League stuff, of course, updates. Again, the homage event seems like it's going to be really good. Again, a lot of events for Pokemon Go right now. The Dragon Spiral Tower event, because all the Unova stuff, new eggs, like smaller eggs, stuff like that, isn't affecting it while standing still. All the new Pokemon spawned. Again, I look at November and it's like, holy crap, November kind of sucked for this though. And I mean, maybe how October was really good. We got all the different, like, Joe Tutorial event coming up. Probably next year we'll go like, at home and uh, all Stardust, you know, games. Again, that's free. That's free Stardust right there and all the spawns that Dino and from Field Research and it can be shiny. Really good. You may purchase a ticket. Goomy's uh, our favorite Pokemon. Took Tick's really good. Uh, the Galaxy of the Goom, um, Pitar, like, do a white bat. Like, they're all really good Pokemon here. I recommend purchasing the tickets. If I could, trust me, I could. I probably would anyway. I knew Song Bat coming up with a lot of new Pokemon spawning. Again, this month is insane though, like holy crap. And the video goes on longer than I expected, sorry about that. Again, there's so much just moves on here and stuff like that though. So, yeah, again, all the um, Twilight Hours, all that stuff though. Of course, again, I had to really go into detail for all the videos though, so yeah. See so, you yeah, guys later though, thanks for watching. Have a great day, go to all good and though. Make sure you stay safe, wash your hands, God bless all of you for going out, put away a mask on top of too. I'm just kidding though, of course, don't do that. If you can get vaccinated, make sure you can, and you know, have a great day. But yeah, we got to think about all this info though. Of course, you like, you hate it. I love it. I think it's awesome. Again, December seems really crazy. All the new events, the free stuff, free Stardust. Holy crap, it's insane right now. Like, it's really insane. Like, this is really freaking insane what they're doing. Dino's like Dino in the, like, pools. He has a chance to be shiny. It's really good. You can form with that candy and stuff like that every week, pretty much. From now until, like, the first. So you have a whole entire month full of Dino potential shinies and all that stuff. I already got my shiny ball, but I'm already, I'm already good. Shiny Dino and a regular Dino and the food research are really good. Again, I got a hundred points of food research. It's insane. It, again, like I might have to break this down like a better video though. Again, like I said, all stuff coming to stuff like that. I did, might probably break it down individually or make it to a short because again there's so much stuff on there though. So yeah, a lot of stuff though, of course. Yeah. See you guys later though, you know.